Nebraska is one of only eight states that have been selected to join the CCSSO Instructional Materials and Professional Development Network, leading the nation in increasing the capacity of districts to provide teachers with high-quality, standards-aligned instructional materials. One of the districts in Nebraska committed to providing high-quality instructional material is Wood River. The biggest area of growth, I feel, is their depth in vocabulary and them using it in not just the reading lesson, um, but also in other subjects, um, science, social studies, and it carrying over. And I've also had parents excited about the vocabulary they're using at home. I'm seeing a carryover with parents being excited about CKLA as well. I think one thing we were really looking for was a strong phonics component. Um, we had Saxon phonics previously and we just know how important um, direct instruction of phonics is. They're using the vocabulary not just when we're doing CKLA during our knowledge time, they're using those vocabulary words in their daily language. Um, so the other day we used the word frigid was our word that we were using during our knowledge time. And so when the kids were talking about the weather that day and writing about the weather, they were saying that it was frigid outside. The Nebraska Instructional Materials Collaborative provides a wealth of tools and resources for districts as they move through the process of selecting and implementing high quality materials. As we implement it, and this is our first year, the teachers are just amazed. Um, they talk about how they never thought these kids would be using the vocabulary that they are. They talk about how excited the kids are about reading instruction. We followed the script, um, we did the motor planning. After every time they would make a letter, we also had them make the sound. We saw some really good things about after a month when they did start introducing the letters rapidly. Um, our kids were able to pick up the letter sounds and the letter names very quickly, including digraphs. We introduced three digraphs in one week, um, CH, SH, and TH. And I have never seen in my last 10 years um, working in the kindergarten room students pick up those sounds as quickly as what they did. CKLA has really helped, I believe, with um, engaging our students in that cognitive development that we've really been working a lot on here at Wood River. And it's really built into the program. So it's helping us as teachers to do what we need to be doing anyway for our kids, to help them be actively engaged in their learning. I've seen how engaging it can be and how motivated the kids can, can be. Um, even some of the topics, the teachers are like, oh, I don't know how they're going to handle this, or are they really going to be interested? And the kids love it. 